What's going on everyone? Milky here. Hope you're doing well. Today we've had a massive update to Marvel Snap, which brings battle mode into the game. Particularly on battle mode, I just wanted to say, if, you are, if you're looking for friends or people to battle, jump over on into our Discord. We have an entire channel dedicated to battle mode now, where you can post your battle codes, you can battle people to your heart's content, you make some friends along the way. It's awesome, so jump into the Discord, and, uh, and if you're into battle mode and everything, it's going to be a great place for you. Um, what we also had in the update was a nerf to leader. It's a pretty significant change, which I make I think makes him potentially nerfed into the ground, but I think there's also some interesting things you could potentially do with him if you shape the game around playing towards him. But the big one that we want to call out is the update or the big buff to Wolverine. Wolverine was originally a two uh, cost three power card, and he's now been changed to a two cost two power card, but his ability has been updated where if he is discarded or destroyed, he will get plus two power each time, and he will still be placed at a random place on the board. So I think there's still that RNG with Wolverine, but this addition of power makes him really, really playable, and I think actually really good card in my opinion. Um, we have a deck that we've done today, and we recently did a video on this style of deck. It's a Destroyer Wave deck, uh, which is really built around, you know, potentially getting out a Destroyer early and then making use of his power in other ways. I think Wolverine fits perfectly into this deck and does super, super well. We've tweaked some other cards in the deck like Hood and bringing in other cards, which I think actually takes this deck to the next level and makes it a really competitive and viable deck. The deck is really based around everything Destroy, multiple ways to destroy uh, Wolverine multiple times and get him really buffed up as well as other cards taking advantage of all the destroy that you have in the deck um th when the when the plays line up with this deck it feels so smooth and simple to play out but super super powerful um I think the additions of Taskmaster and Venom in there alongside Death just make this deck feel super super slick um I wouldn't be surprised if this actually becomes a really powerful deck in a lot of ways and I know I've been enjoying it ever since the Wolverine buff so stick around, check out the gameplay, jump in the Discord if you're looking for battle mode um, and some friends along the way. Uh, I'm going to take off for now, but it's been a pleasure, and I'll catch you in the next one. Anything else? However, if we can get the Venom to go left, uh, go right. Okay, very nice, very nice. Ooh, okay, very nice for us. So for this one, I think we just do this one. Yeah, and I, I don't think there's a way that we lose this. He could buff this with Spectrum, though. That could go a little crazy with Spectrum. Ooh, do we lose this? Oh my gosh, crazy game. Crazy game. Can be... Fantastic with Venom, um, depending on what what goes what goes down. All right, that could also be fantastic with Venom, depending on what we get. So do you want to go down this route and just like do the Venom thing? Let's go with this for now. We have potentially three locations, which is just great with Venom. Now I'm like regretting doing this. We could do this just to get rid of his sunspot. But what's the end game with that? I think this is probably just our tempo play that we make. All right, so no, we won't be able to do any sort of Galactus this game. Destroyer. That's kind of cool. Okay, that was unfortunate for him. So what we can do is we can do this and eat all of this now. Providing actually a pretty decent buff to the rest of the board. 
We also make death cheaper. It's going to be 11 over here. I'll do this. I'll do this. Because then we, we... The reason I'm doing this is we line up for a Killmonger on him on the final turn, which doesn't affect us as much. Okay. Okay, now I need to just think about what is best here. This gives us three locations with Shang Chiable things. This pushes us further ahead here. I think this also lines up for a Taskmaster if we draw it. What would be another play we could do? You can also just do like this. Maybe this is just actually better. Hobgoblin there is awkward. We can, uh, we can play all three locations with this. Which I don't mind. Surely he's got to think he's won this. He might find a way to win this. I don't think he can find a way to win both of these. So I go with this. Destroy his destroyer doesn't do anything here. I feel like death on the last turn is like not not good enough. So I, I actually like this play. And we get the retreat in the end. Um, but doing Wolverine here a little bit early on is uh, its probably not ideal. And we're versing a Wolverine, so it's super cool. Um, oh, okay. Lamentus won. This could be interesting. We do get death off the top, which is really, really nice. Okay, so what we can do is we can... We can do our... We can really line up our carnage right now, should we want it. we got to think about the ways to maximize our power here. So almost certainly our target is going to be... See, I do this because we're going to... That, that's a cool little play. Whoa. That was, uh, <laughs> that was pretty sick audio. Uh, we, can do, we can do this. We start lining up something for Taskmaster as well. Taskmaster almost certainly going to be on death. So we'll do this. Does a little carnage play himself. Okay, that's, that's cool. Bob. It's got a really I insane kind of echo that's on... Set, um... Bob. <laughs> we'll be hearing this a lot, huh? Okay, so his uh, Sabretooth gets destroyed there, which is kind of cool. Um... I wonder if he has a... We could save this for the final turn if we want to. These two get destroyed doing this. Just trying to think, like we can't do we can't do our Killmonger ever. Because of this. Do we just pass here? I mean this. This guarantees that they both die. Little, it's a little awkward this play, but I think we're, I think we'll go with this route. Enough said, Bob. Damn, I was hoping he was gonna land back there. Enough said, Bob. He could very easily have a. He could very easily have a. Um, A death of his own or a killmonger. This guarantees that we kill his uh This guarantees that we kill his deathlock. I think we'll do this. It's kind of a kind of a little bit of an awkward game. But um like we're able to generate a good amount of power here. We could have also done 
Death Taskmaster into Baxter. Which could have been a thing. That's interesting. Oh, okay. The cheeky Death Zola play. So he's got us here. He's definitely got us here. Good play, good play. Nice play. Very nice play. The Arnim Zola is a, a nice, a nice addition. I don't mind the Arnim Zola. If we draw a destroyer, we can be in a really good, really good shape here. Wow, he just throws out a random armor. That is so unfortunate. Okay. Um. Well, we might have to wave here. Just wave, I think. Like, regardless, we're going to get value out of um, playing death here. So we can do death, and then we can do... Um, he, he probably just plays his own death here. Okay, sure. He's committed a lot to there, so I think we're okay with this. We can do... Um, I don't think we're getting a better target than death for Taskmaster. Nova, Daredevil, Carnage, okay. Okay, I think we're still in a decent spot here. Um... I think this is the most power we can get out. This is only six. Technically, no, can't do that. This is four, this is seven. Yeah, th I think this is the most power we can get out. Cosmo and Killmonger. We end up getting the win there. That was really cheeky. I mean, he even had a huge shutdown play on us over here. And maybe we should have given up on that right then. Maybe we should have just played the death elsewhere. But yeah, we get out the win. We got a we got a good hand here. We can um if we do draw a destroyer here, we can play wave. Uh, I think I want to do this because wave's not going to have any effect anyways. So let's get the ball rolling on this Wolverine play. Really hope Wolverine goes to Atlantis. Set, bub. Okay, that's fine too. That's fine too. Oh, I can't. I, can't believe that changed to Machine World. Out of all of the locations it changed to. Machine World. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do a... A Death Venom over in Atlantis, maybe? Okay, what do we do here? Is this actually worth it? I think it is worth it. It also gives us a death taskmaster final turn. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. This is actually, like, it looks counterproductive with the demon, but this is actually good. Is actually very good for us in a lot of ways. Ah, uh, so this is Silver Surfer deck, I guess? See, it seems that way. Okay, so we want to probably play into both of these. So I think we just do these two. Silver Surfer over there is just, it's too much, I think. 
And I think we need to spread power in both of these. So let's do this. Oh, it's Patriot server. So he went, he went hard into that machine world location. So we are uh, we we wrap this one up. Very nice, very nice. The Cyclops there will go pretty close. Um, but yeah, he he went hard. We can have a turn three. I don't think we need to. I think we, we actually get some more value out of this. This is a Lady Sif. Okay, so, so this looks like an Apocalypse deck. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Alright, what do we got here? District X. Not what you want to see. Not what you want to see, but um, we do have a She-Hulk and Death from District X, which is kind of cracked. Let's go ahead and do our destroyer now, I think. We do our destroyer. We've uh we've lined up the game. Oh, reconnecting. Alright, we're back. So here you got a quick silver, okay. Sure. Um I think we definitely make this play. That's not going to be that cheap. That's kind of a shame. But, I mean, we we still have... Um, we still have decent plays that we can make. Um... I think we just spread power on the board here. We can we can do like Angela Demon Electro final turn, which is actually a pretty insane power push as well. He discarded Ghost Rider there. He actually, I think that could have been a Ghost Rider from. So I think I think we 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 go down this route. I think that might have been a Ghost Rider from um, District X, not his. Is it this way? We spread across all three locations. Okay, uh, I'll go ahead and skip. We have the um, Destroyer Wave play, which is kind of sick. Ideally, we'd love to get out like Wolverine or Bucky before that, but it's not going to happen. So we'll just do this. We'll play um, we'll play Double Wave anyways because of um, because of Death. So I think that's going to be strong. We we got some really cool play lines here. We can make we could. Do destroyer. Okay, this is so awkward now. This is awkward now. So we do this. We can do. We just throw out destroyer here because it's our most power. Uh, what could he have here? He could have um, Jessica Jones. He could have. Anything. It's wave. So he could really have anything. Okay, so Jessica Jones. Jessica Jones gonna take him up a bit. He might skip here with Sunspot as well, but maybe we draw Killmonger, which is kind of kind of slick if we do. Okay, so we have Taskmaster here. We can actually take Nova up a little bit. Uh, take Destroyer up a little bit too with Nova. All right, so this is our this is our play. Got Black Panther. So you could run a Zola in this deck. Well, I, I almost assume that he does. This might be our best play that we can make. No Killmonger. Unfortunate. He might, he might skip here. I don't know. He would have to skip um, four energy to beat us. Or, yeah, four energy to beat us. Three energy to draw. Depends where Wolverine goes as well. All right, what is this? Is he going for the Zola play? Set, okay, not bad for us. Actually pretty good. 
She goes to the Zola. Oh my gosh, she gets to the Zola. That is so unlucky. That is so unlucky. Again, we've got Shadowland. Actually a pretty great location for us. So we can um we can do our destroyer if we get wave. If not, I think we'll just go down the carnage route. We can uh we can drop the hood here if we get hood. Let's just go ahead and get the ball rolling here with um with carnage. Ooh, interesting a cerebro list. So it's like is this a Cerebro 2 with Lizard, or is it Cerebro 5? Surely you wouldn't do Cerebro... Cerebro 5, right? With Lizard? That would be... Well, I mean, Cerebro 2 with Lizard, it relies on me... I don't know. Playing in there. We can add, uh, we can add 13 Taskmaster, which isn't bad either. Also making death a bit cheaper for the final turn. Never a bad thing. Mega red. So it is Cerebro 5. So is he just given up on the uh, on the bar with no name? That is interesting. So we can wave here. And we can play both of these on the final turn, which is probably the play. We kind of mess him up as well. Yeah, although we have one more power on Taskmaster, this is definitely the play. Let's do this. So we just, uh, we double down on a single location because he's given up bar with no name, it looks like. Actually, we, we, what we should have done is played, um, played wave here and just gone all in on Shadowland, but it's fine. Maybe he hasn't given up on bar with no name. Storm, he storms it out, okay. Because this is Cerebro 5 with Storm. Okay, we have to go in here now. Um, so we do one, two. I think that's going to be it. He could, he could win now. The Storm was a cheeky play. Dr. Doom? I think we beat Dr. Doom. Yeah, we do. We do. This is a really, really cool Cerebro list. Um... Kind of wasn't expecting it. Do this. You got a. Uh, we got Deathlock, Venom. Got some cool plays. We have Death in hand for this, so. All right. No wave. Means. We're probably not playing Death this game. Ah, uh, Destroyer this game. But what we can do is this. And we get a absolutely massive venom if we if we line this up well. That's really annoying and very rude. Um I don't think we What else could we do? We could do this. This We can do Venom, Task... Yeah, we still, we still have a great play here. I don't think we're even using the Nova this game. Doesn't really matter, to be honest. Maximus? Sure. We can come back and win that later on. Okay, so we did this. We get an 18... We're able to play all the locations on the final turn. It's kind of nutty. Does he have a Shang-Chi? Shang-Chi actually doesn't matter too much because he thinks he's won this, right? Hmm. Okay, so what we need to do is put this here and put this here. I think I think we've lost this. This is actually just more power anyways, rather than destroy, uh, destroyer. No. 
Well, this is an 18. Killing this with Destroyer makes this... This is 18 minus 2 plus 1. Okay, no. This is still just one more power. Yeah. So we do this, we do this. I mean, anything. Rhino. Silver Surfer. I knew it. Okay. You get the win here. Very nice. Very nice. I like this play because we played all three locations. The other the other play, we could have doubled down here, but... Um, I mean, maybe that, that was the better play, but then we have kind of like gimped power elsewhere. I like this. All right, so for this one, we've got... We lost our, our uh, Taskmaster, the Sokovia. He lost his Moon Girl. So, could be like a... Uh, uh, yeah, like a Devil Dino hand size style deck. No worries. No worries. Well, that's going to be nice. Um, we could actually line it up to potentially get destroyed twice. Uh, really quickly, which could be cool. Maybe we maybe we get the Deathlock roll on uh, on Wolverine landing middle. Would be perfect, actually. Ooh, we could, we could destroy him a lot this game, too. We'll see. We'll do this. So if, we, see if we can't get him up to um, 7 power right off the bat. Okay, unlucky. Unlucky. Could have had one additional destroy, but uh, we're okay with that. We'll do... I think we'll do this. And pass. This is kind of awkward. But I think we just do this and pass. Yeah, he just passes anyway, so turn four Zabu passes kind of crazy. This is where you can really get Wolverine up and rolling. We could have been, and we could have had an additional two power here. He could be a nine right now. Heading into uh, being an eleven, but he's he's only gonna be a nine after this, but still pretty crazy play. That's cheeky. That's cheeky. He does slow play it on Sokovia, though. Carnage. So we, we could actually do some craziness here. Like, th this seems counterproductive, but this might be cheeky. This might be cheeky, hey. The other thing that we do is we, we safe play it and we just drop death here. And we just say that he's not going to have anything bigger than devil, like a devil dino. A devil dino in his hand, though, is uh is pretty big. That's 10, 13. So we actually lose the devil dino here. So we actually have to go for this play because we, we're guessing that we're losing devil dino. didn't have the devil dino so he would have won but we still have a chance here we actually we actually have a, a really good chance oh the 66 percent chance of winning the game and we didn't win it all right so this one we got hell's kitchen we got wave and destroyer which is very nice so we can uh we'll just throw out our nova here very cool got the same variant We'll do We'll do a Bucky here. We'll do Bucky and then we'll do Do like Wave Venom. We can do lots of different stuff here. Oh we can do Wave, sorry. We got we got a hood for that if we do draw hood. We I think we just do wave here and then we do destroyer into Warrior Falls, probably. Probably our best play. Oh, the sound just died. I think the sound just died in my game. The game volume just died. Uh, I'll do this. I 
We've got Sarah. So is this a miracle list? This looks like a miracle list. Oh, I don't know if they run Shang-Chi in this list. It very well could. Hood off the top locks us in. Hood off the top does lock us in here. Could have also um, like Venom this turn, but I don't think Venom actually does does all that much for us, to be honest. Let's try and beat sixteen middle. It's gonna be interesting. You could do it. That's a weird play. Unless you can storm this. Is this something we want to do? I feel like, why would he do this? Does he have a storm? Makes me scared that he has a storm. So I'm going to do this. We had a bit of power middle. Could he just like thrown out the uh, the death middle as well? This has got to be a storm. It has to be a storm. I mean, we lose to storm there, though. Scarlet Witch. Okay, okay. How does he beat us here? Sentinel into... Lizard? Okay, now we win this one. We win this one. Very nice. I knew there was something janky going on in, in uh, right lane. 